This is the North Carolina Zoo's R.J. Reynolds Forest Aviary, recognized by the national newspaper USA Today as one of the best natural habitat exhibits in American zoos. But since it opened in 1982, the aviary has also been recognized for a number of the most significant bird hatchings among U.S. zoos. The latest addition to that well-deserved reputation is the first American hatching of a golden white eye, a bright yellow and green bird native to the Marianas Islands in the western Pacific. The golden white eyes are a small pastern or songbird. They are bright yellow in appearance, hence the name uh, golden, and white eye comes from the light white ring formed around their eye. They are actually classified as critically endangered species due to the fact that the island that they are native to in Saipan has had problems with an introduction of a brown tree snake, which in the near future is expected to decimate the white eye population, so proactive measures have been taken to establish a captive breeding program. Currently in the United States, there are 40 golden white eyes being held in captivity. Here at the North Carolina Zoo, we have four. We have two here in our aviary on exhibit, and we also have another breeding pair that is held off exhibit. The golden white eyes are an important species for us to be working with because we are participating in establishing a captive breeding population to sustain numbers for the future of the species in the wild. The aviary's success in breeding rare birds has made the North Carolina Zoo a leader in the nationwide effort by zoos to save endangered species. If you'd like to learn more about the aviary or any of the zoo's other exhibits, please check out our website at nczoo.org. I'm Rod Hackney reporting for the Zoo Files, connecting your life to wildlife.